Did Beyonce just shut down the rumors being spread by an alleged ex-bodyguard? For the past week or so, someone has been lying on Beyonce's internet, trying to get clout, and Beyonce finally said, enough is enough. <laughs> so, from breaking the internet with her $24 million performance in Dubai, that inspired an all new round of TikTok challenges of everyone trying to sing her drunken love run, to people trying to sell organs, houses, setting up GoFundMes, and literally blowing up relationships to buy tickets for the Renaissance World Tour, to even Etsy shops closing down because too many people are trying to buy the disco ball cowboy hat that Beyonce wore in this picture. Beyonce took some time out from her busy schedule to drop a remix to her hit song, Cuff It. Now for those of you who don't know, this guy right here has been claiming that he knows Beyonce's deepest secrets because he used to be her ex-bodyguard. Now, apparently there are some pictures that could be him guarding Beyonce back in 2004. But so far, nothing has been confirmed. Anyway, in a now deleted TikTok, one of the most salacious claims he made was about the use of substances. Now this isn't the first time that rumors like these have circulated. So of course, people started bringing up video clips that show Beyonce rocking back and forth and looking a bit zoned out from a November 2014 Nets game which was about six months after Solange whooped Jay-Z up and down in that elevator. Now, if anyone knows anything about musicians, it's that they can hear music in their head anywhere, anytime. So when you look at the whole video, you can clearly see Beyonce was chopping it up with her less than faithful spouse and probably working out the lyrics and video concept to Sorry from the Lemonade album. Not to mention getting a head start on the Renaissance album. The next thing people used to back up those substance claims were the lyrics for Cuff It, the part in the chorus where Beyonce sings, she needs a prescription, she wanna go higher, and for all y'all who've suspected for years that Beyonce has a burner account, following everything that goes down on social media and then moving in silence. Well, just last night on February 3rd, 2023, Beyonce stepped in the rain and dropped the Cuff It Wetter remix, which is based on the mashup that DJ Eccentric created with Cuff It and Twista's Wetter that took over TikTok last October. Beyonce went in the studio and slowed the song down and laid out new lyrics and even some ad libs that directly addressed the rumors that have been circulating. She said, don't need no prescription. I can't get no higher. She's clearly saying, she doesn't need any other substance because love is her high. Which gotta be true because ain't no natural substance out there that could have made this match. So what do you think now that the alleged ex-bodyguard has said he will no longer be speaking on anything that has to do with the Carters and has taken down all his TikToks related to them did Beyonce just shut down all the substance rumors with this Cuff It remix? Remember to like and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Have fun today.